there. Would you like to buy skincare that actually works for a change? Would you like to purchase an anti-aging regime that's actually going to work and is affordable? If that sounds like it's you, stay tuned to find out more. Hi there and welcome to my channel. My name is Anne Britt and today we're going to talk about my skincare routine. Now, before I take you into <clears throat> my morning routine and show you that, first of all, I'm going to talk about why I purchased the lime smoothing regime from Rock Skincare. <clears throat> Number one, because it contains retinol. Moi is mature, I can assure you. And, okay, retinol addresses definitely my skincare concerns. It's the number one proven anti-aging ingredient. It's good for oily skin that has a lot of open pores. And it's proven, obviously, for anti-aging to do with fine lines and wrinkles. Let's be real about it. Okay. Um, now, the regime that I bought, I'd actually seen results from rock skin care in the past. Um, I had used it off and on for two years, off and on, why, why off and on? Because the supplier where I live, the pharmacy kept running out or was inconsistent and didn't have all the products that I gave in and I purchased online. So in this skincare um, regime, what came was the lime smooth and retinal correction dual cleansing pads the retinal correction eye cream, the line smooth and daily serum, the maximum hydration cream, and the line smooth and capsules. Now that was a total regime for $99. That's a very good price for a total skincare regime, especially one that has retinol in it. Now they actually sent me an extra one of these because my purchase was over $75. I think that's what it was back then, because this was a couple of months ago. So I'm on to the second one now. So without further ado, I'm going to show you uh, my morning skincare routine. And then And good morning and welcome to my morning routine. So first off, what I do is I splash my face with water. I double cleanse at night time. Then, first up what I'll do is use my Rock Retinol Eye Cream. This eye cream is excellent. I'll definitely keep using this within the routine. Does not irritate your eyes. Perfect texture, consistency, great under makeup. And fights them pesky, pesky dark circles. Then I'll use the Rock Retinol line smoothing daily serum two to three drops I do not apply the applicator straight on the face <laughs> that's the totally wrong way to do it that's just an Instagram strange thing I don't know why they do that because it's very unhygienic and yeah it's just silly so I apply this we're going to talk about this after I show you the demo of what I do. So three to four drops of this on the face and neck. Then to seal the serum in, I use the Retinal Correction Maximum Deep Hydration Cream. 
this is extremely hydrating okay so hydrating if for me oily skin it was sometimes too hydrating <laughs> but oily skin gets dehydrated too and no I'm not being iron hygienic it's near the end of this I'm actually going on to a new regime so that's why I'm doing this video to review the retinal correction line smoothing but all the products I've actually really liked them. Simple morning routine. Um, if I was going outside, obviously I'd be using this SPF on top of this because this moisturizer does not has does not have SPF factor. So now let's review and talk about it. Okay, so in the AM and the PM, I actually used the eye cream. Now this eye cream addresses dark circles, which I definitely have wrinkles for sure and puffiness now i don't get puffiness around the eye area only if i'm allergic which has happened in the past to eye creams because i'm extremely sensitive around the eye area and also my facial skin even though it's oily so with this i was really really impressed and actually my dark circles have drastically improved the fine lines i mean come on it's not going to totally take them away but it has improved um, just here I look so much more, my skin in general is so much more vibrant and brighter. So this, what I also loved about it is the texture, um, perfect texture, not too thick, not too thin, perfect under makeup, does not interfere with un uh, your makeup at all, um, perfect hydration and I really, really love this, very good for sensitive skin. So don't let the word retinol scare you. Actually, these products are very good. They're hypoallergenic, so they're very actually good for sensitive skin. So with this is definitely, I'm keeping this within my regime. So what you also see me use in the morning was the, in the dropper format, this here, the daily serum. Now this was gorgeous i mean for and it's the their products actually smell nice as well it's just like a very light clean smell nothing heavy fragranced at all this and the in the dropper form and with the capsules at night well i won't go into that right now but with this um the hydration it's basically the squalene ingredient keeps your skin really hydrated and it also has ashwagandha which is an ancient herb which is um, good for boosting the collagen and the squalene is actually a mega hydrator so your skin feels super super hydrated with this it's, um, I don't know it was just so soothing on the skin I really loved this um so that was excellent that and actually it's very powerful it actually um the retinol is active for 12 hours okay so that's that one i'm just trying to keep it easier meaning for morning versus night time so in the morning i also used the well for daytime the retinol correction the cream which as you can see with the videos it's finished now now the maximum daily hydration cream this is a 24 hour moisturizing cream for sure sometimes the hydration is too much for me even though you know my skin is not as oily as it used to be because of age now but my skin can still get dehydrated even if your skin is extremely dehydrated and you put this on unbelievable just brings your skin back to life this was fantastic as well in fact i liked all the products to be honest with you i was really impressed especially for the price point um and you know because it had retinol now some of the products they'll say start using it every other day you may get a slight tingling sensation my skin is super sensitive and i never once had any tingling sensation i use these products every day 
so yeah very good for sensitive skin um, <clears throat> this the retinol correction maximum hydration cream this has hyaluronic acid in it so it keeps the skin really plump super hydrated so yeah that was fantastic too so what I'm going to do is now show you the nighttime routine so golden argons Boa noite and good evening. Yes, I have many talents. Just joking. So the skincare routine for nighttime, okay? Now, as a spa therapist, I was a bit dubious about these, but what the hell? I mean, it came within a whole regimen regimen for $99. You cannot complain. It's got retinol, right? Yes, you'll notice I keep going on about retinol because it fights all that anti-aging with that stuff so what I would do if I had makeup on which I haven't right now but for the line smoothing daily cleansing pads okay what I would do if I had makeup on I would take off my makeup with eye makeup remover I use L'Oreal uh, clean artist because that's really good for sensitive eyes and it takes off waterproof any stubborn eyeliner etc very good dupe for Lancome bifacial just so you know and I would use the my cellular cleansing water um, I like to double cleanse especially if I'm wearing makeup so that's the purpose I would double cleanse at the end of the day get all the grime off, all the makeup off. Now, if I'm not wearing makeup, I would still use this at night time. Now, let me explain to you. It comes as a pad, right? And it has a foamy lather within it. So I'm gonna dampen my face, and then I'm gonna show you me applying this. So the one side is for general cleansing. The other side is for exfoliating. Now, as I say, it's a bit dubious about, see, this is the last one. I was leaving it for the video because <laughs> I'm changing the regime, as I said. Um, still using rock, but a different cleanser and a different nighttime. I'll go over that later. But I'm going to dampen my face and show you what I mean. But they say you could use this for use uh, removing eye makeup, but I'm sorry, no. I will not put nothing soapy near my face. I know it's not soap, but you understand what I'm saying. Lathery near my eyes. This actually smells really nice and it does make your skin squeaky clean. And the other side is for exfoliating. Now, if I felt my skin was a little bit more on the dry side, yes, I would use that. But, no, as I said, I got a thing about pads and wipes being a a spa therapist you know I prefer like a, a cleanser that's more hands-on you know not really empty pads but you know these were actually pretty nice um, it wasn't as scary as I thought it would be so now I'm going to rinse off retinol correction eye cream I am definitely keeping this within the regime my new regime I've definitely seen my results with this, but as I say, when you're using non-prescription skincare that has retinol, you have to give it longer to give the results. So be patient, guys. Now, the nighttime is slightly different. This used to be full. <laughs> and this, as I say, is the the last capsule I've been saving for this video. So these capsules here is the line smoothing capsules and it's basically a serum. So you twist it off. You do not do all this crap. <laughs> That's for Instagram. Okay, so I, you'll notice that I always put on the palm of my hand here and then I'm going to put it on. So in the, start, 
the serum, and you can just see it's like a clear liquid. These capsules I actually loved. Um, I would notice in the morning my skin just looks so much rejuvenated would be the best way to say it. I really found a difference with these but I did not reorder them because I'm actually going on to a specific stronger treatment um, for retinol for night time. So that was it for my evening routine. If I needed more moisture, which mm, 9 times out of 10 not, the capsule was enough, I would put the, um, the Hydration Max Cream on top, but that's very rare. Um, I'm one of these people that's got oily skin, even though I'm aging it's still oily. So. Let's talk about the nighttime routine. So you've just seen the nighttime routine. So I'm going to review about the cleansing pads. So I kept the old one here so I could show you. Basically, this side is texture for exfoliating and the other side is smooth for cleansing. Now I didn't take off my eye makeup with this. I'm, I just won't put anything foamy near my eye area. But as for taking off, um, makeup although I do double cleanse it's just by nature I think I'm not used to it when I do facials on clients like just double cleansing has always been a thing for me for years but especially with wearing makeup I like to double cleanse at night so these were I was actually quite impressed because I'm more of a hands-on cleanser kind of person but these made your skin feel super clean, wasn't drying in any shape or form. Um, I know that coconut oil is one of the ingredients in glycerine that's in this, so these were perfectly good as well. There was 28 pads that came um, in the container. Now, the capsules, none is left. <laughs> there was 30 capsules that came. Now, I used this at night time, as you've seen the video, and I showed you the last. Uh, capsule. These were amazing, amazing. What I was most impressed by from the whole regime was the two serums, the daily serum that I put on before the hydration cream, the eye cream and the capsule that you used at night time. So at night time I basically just used the eye cream and the night time capsule. This, because it's tight and a capsule has the purest form of retinol in it so this it has a retinol and the mixture of because it's tight vacuum packed um, it has the ceramides and also antioxidants so this was I would say between this and the eye cream was the fastest I've seen the results to do with my skin this your skin just looks so rejuvenated the next morning. In general my skin with these products was much more vibrant, much more healthier. The pore size has decreased a little bit but as we know when you're using retinol within skincare that you buy you know regular you have to give it longer for the results than you do for prescription retinol. So you know I'll keep seeing how, it, how my skin is going because I'm still going to be using the rock skincare. What I am changing in my routine is I'm going to be using a different cleanser. It's still the rock but it's actually the new one, the serum cleanser. And I'm going to be using the resurfacing system for night time which is two, a serum and a cream. Um, I just want to see if that gives me more results, otherwise um, I will go back to the capsules. But generally speaking, with me being a therapist and I have worked with so many different skincare brands on clients and then I've been able to use them myself also. I'm talking about high end that I have, you know, hundreds of dollars on my face. 
nothing has super wowed me nothing especially eye cream has been my biggest nightmare trying to find a decent eye cream that didn't inflame you know my skin or cause redness or the actual opposite of what it's supposed to do but with the rock one absolutely amazing i mean this is 24.99 um on its own but if you buy the eye cream, you can buy it in bundles or with, say, the whole skincare regime. You'll find it much cheaper than buying it individual. So, yeah, the serums and the eye cream was mostly what I was blown away with. Absolutely brilliant results. Um, obviously, because the percentage is lower in skincare that you're buying, you know, over the counter, you have to wait longer for the results to show. Um, maybe if you've got acne skin, you'll see results within a few weeks. But if you're like me and it's for pigmentation and general aging, it can take 12 weeks or up to six months because the retinal percentage is obviously lower. And then what the retinal does is it, it converts into retinoic acid and then that stimulates the skin cells the turnover to get rid of the dead skin and then <clears throat> excuse me yeah and then you're boosting collagen production so for me it's fantastic the because the price point is excellent actually it's the opposite of what you think is it absolutely brilliant for sensitive skin is very affordable dermatologist tested so i trust that i trust the science and you know for me I'm not into fluff. I'm not going to pay a lot of money, especially being in the industry. Um, I know what ingredients to look for. So I'm not going to pay a lot of money that I don't have to just for fancy packaging or, you know, like basically you're paying for the packaging and the marketing. I want non-fluff. I want ingredients that work that's not a lot of crap basically <laughs> to put it in realistic terms so um that is my review of the rock skincare line smoothing regime i will obviously be producing more videos about you know what else i'm going to be using in the rock skincare but obviously i have to wait because you know you can't review something when you've only been using it a week or two especially when it's containing retinol so I hope you found this helpful and um, I'm going to leave a link in the description um, which actually I have an affiliate code that will give you 25% off if you would be interested in trying the retinol and um, any other rock skincare. So until next time, thank you for watching and bye.